Hello guys, I'm Jun and welcome to my channel. For today's topic, we're going to discuss about constructing a double vertical bar graph. A double bar graph is used to display two sets of data on the same graph. For example, if you wanted to show the number of hours that student work in one month compared to the other month, we would use a double bar graph. The information in a double bar graph is related and it compares one set of data to another. A double bar graph is made in the same way that a single bar graph is made except that instead of one bar of data, there will be two bars of data. Here are the steps for constructing vertical double bar graph. Step number one, collect all your data. For the step number one, here is the data for the number of ice cream cones sold each week at an ice cream stand during the months of July and August. Step number two. Draw the two axes. One with the items being counted is your x-axis, and one with the scale that is going to be used to count is your y-axis. For the step number two, this is your week numbers. This is the items being counted, so this will be your x-axis. and. This one will be your, and one with the skill that is going to be used to count, this will be your Y axis. So we're going to draw the X axis. So we have the week numbers. So we have the week 1, week 2, week 3 and week 4. This will become your week. Then, draw the y-axis. Step number 3. Decide on the base scale to use given the data. Okay, for the step number 3. So, as you notice, the lowest number is 500 and the highest number is 900, this one. So if you notice, the best scale is multiple of 100. So we have from 100 to 900. Step number 4. Draw the bars to show the data. For the step number 4, we are now going to draw the bars to show the data. First, we are going to draw for the week number 1 up to week number 4. So go back to the graph. So we have July and August. So first we're going to draw the bars for the July. Then after that we're going to draw the bars for the August. So in week number one we have 500, 800 for the week number two, 700 for week number three, and 900 for week number four. Okay, we're now going to draw the bars 500 for week number one 
804 week number 2 704 week number 3 and 904 week number 4 for the month of August week 1 is 800 904 week number 2 604 week number 3 and 804 week number 4 Okay, for the month of August, week 1, we have 800, 900 for week 2, 600 for week 3, and 800 for week 4. Step number 5. Draw one category in one color and... The other category in another color. Let's say blue and purple color. For the step number five, as you notice, we use two different colors to distinguish the two categories. So as you can see, we have a legend here. Sometimes it is called key. I used color blue for July and I used purple for August. Okay. The last but not the least. Step number six. Interpret your data. Now that you have already drawn your vertical double bar graph, you can now interpret your data. You may have learned from this video of mine, don't forget to leave your comment below and hit the like button. Don't forget also to subscribe to my channel. Until next video, thanks for watching guys. Bye bye.